This is Thomas Lynn as a student, a college student that is very good at uh, what we call the Chinese yo-yo. Let him speak then, okay? Can we clap for him so I don't have to speak? Thank you. It's called the Chinese yo-yo. It is also called Diablo. Even though it was invented first in China, it has been then popularized in Taiwan as part of their gym curriculum. And this used to be made of wood, but in recent developments in like the early 21st century, they changed it to plastic so it's more durable and goes faster and we're able to do so many more tricks with them. So good, laying there wearing nothing but my t shirt. Eyes and neighborhood. Wanna drive my lips all around you, cause I'm all in my head. You're gonna wake up in my head. You don't want your blood hearts beating. I can't wait to kiss you. Each morning, you wake up in my head. You don't want your blood
started in Chinese school, they teach a lot of culture and these were one of the courses that were offered. My mom signed me up for one of these courses and I cried on my first day. It was scary. All these older kids, they were doing all these random tricks, throwing the yo-yo around. I was scared. <laughs> but I came back the next week and found it to be way more fun than I originally thought. So my message to you guys, to all you little ones, is even though something isn't fun at first, you gotta keep trying. Maybe you'll discover a new passion. Now, who would like to get a chance to try this? Yeah? I saw this young man's hand first. Right here, yeah? Okay, that's all the time we have for today. Thank you again so much.